if you're a yogi, to go to India is like really like coming home. And to go to Rishikesh, the home of the yogis, is so like coming home to your own heart. I found those who were unhappy, confused, didn't know what to do their, with their lives, they would go, they would take the teacher's training in India, and everything would get clarified. Friendships that grow, they'll never be replaced with anything better because you grew together like from children into these beings that had a sense of self-love and who they were and who they would be becoming and that they would go back to all corners of the earth. And I've traveled the world over and there's beautiful places and beautiful history beautiful heritage, beautiful mountains, beautiful rivers, beautiful peoples, but there is nothing on this planet Earth like India. You feel really ancient, and yet you feel like a child. So much knowingness that's always been inside of you, but somehow India allows you to be free, to be free to trust your intuition, to know God, and to know your mission. Years and years I've gone to India. Every time I'm with my friends or with students, we talk about it and we just start laughing and our eyes get so big. Those who haven't been, we just look at them and say, you just have to go. We can't explain it until you go. The days in teacher's training are filled with laughter, spontaneity, taking breath walks up the mountain, going down to the Ganga and giving yourself to her water, sitting, meditating, asking, the mother, the great river for answers, rising early, going to sadhana, eating really good food, and then we get to go out and we get to be in the marketplace and meet all the vendors. India captures the child in you. It captures the wisdom and the ancient soul that we all are. When we're called to come home to India. Many of us know that famous saying of Gandhi, be the change that you want to see in the world. If you come, and my prayers are that you will, you will become that change. And then we're a golden chain of change, and that change will bring in this next five generations, the prayer of Yogi Bhajans. Don't even think twice. Some of you say, well, I don't have the money or the time, but you do. Just declare it. Say, I'm going to India. I'm going to take teacher's training in September, beginning September 24th, 2016. Done deal. It's an adventure that begins and it never ends. India calls you home. Home to where? Home to yourself.